everyone, this is General and welcome back to another Let's Play Rise of the Three Kingdoms. So, in our previous video, we Hail had another decisive king. battle with the Liu clan by defeating their remaining armies near Xiao Pai. And so, we defeated three armies in all. And so, off screen, I moved Hail a bunch of these guys and we sorted all the armies Hail just so king. that we're not wasting time in the video. It will be an so, honor in Liu. Defeating you. Yeah. Cheng Dui is over here, and now that the Liu clan has decided to enemy. lift their siege off of Zhang Chun and attack Guo Ling, this is a good opportunity Hail to wipe king. out this army or take this settlement. But if I do this, they might come off of the, they might lift their siege here and try to Hail save them. So I'm gonna kill this isolated army. Oh, first, we shall we're gonna engage. fight this on the battlefield. So if we isolate our enemy and take them out while they're you know, weak, this is a good choice in my opinion because then they won't be able to hang out in a city and hold walls where they could have a potential advantage. So let's see, these guys over here, number two. This will be group one, two, three. We'll have a group four over here. We'll have a very heavy cavalry on this side. Surround them over here. Then these guys over here. Let's see. The army consists of mostly swordsmen, crossbowmen, and several county spearmen. You notice that they have some decent armor. Or do they? Let's see. Nope, just regular armor. Alright, we're already shooting. We're just being very aggressive, that's all. Charge! County Spearman. And I'm back! Alright, just had to get the door really quick. It didn't, look, it didn't look like I missed too much. Looks like the battle is still going well. I'm gonna stop the archers from friendly fire now. I'm gonna get these guys to pull out. Oh yeah! Uh, kill those guys now. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash All right. them. What are those guys doing? Chasing them down. Very good. Okay. Alright. The battle is pretty much ours at this point. We need everyone to charge. Fast forward this, continue the battle for a few more seconds. Oh, and we got the general. 
capture or kill? Kill. All right, so that's all I really all wanted. Will be awed by the 238, so that is good. We killed the general with minimal losses, and no we took out another army off the like field. This, so we can actually ransom them. I'm actually going to do it, glory, mainly because, honor, well, victory. this general unit wasn't that great. Anyway, so you'll see that the ransom units went back into this settlement, and that's perfectly fine. Hail my king! Normally, if there was like more than one general, I probably would have killed them. But eh, this time around, we'll we'll spare them. Hail my king. So I'm gonna go back into With my territories, honor, and we'll use that newfound money to do king. something. Maybe retrain some men. Ooh, I can retrain these guys. So I'll do that. Alright, so trade increase, 5 victories, plus 2 authority, breakthrough, relations at well, that's gonna happen. Hail my king. Hail so, my king. since they lifted the siege off of Runan, I'm going to do something there, but before I Hail do, I'm going king. to marshal the northern front, now will, my king, to battle. We'll maintain the siege Sorry. here, As you wish, we'll attack Sire. Zincheng. Take another settlement, and we'll auto resolve. Okay, we lost about 260 men, so not the best auto resolve, but we took the settlement off of the rebels, the day is ours, and that sire. is good enough. Yama, we'll bang a few heads, get some monies, build a small market, repair everything else, then do that. Auto. Auto manage with a military. Well, we'll do a financial policy. Hail my king! And for now, I'm going to keep all my men in there. Yes, my lord. All right. Let us settle. Hm. And Sire. here we approach. Yes, my lord. Can I cannot look at Jingzhou's forces. Defeating you. Let us settle matters war. on the field of battle. Pretty loyal guy. I don't know why he's like just standing around there. Defeating. Hail my king! Orders. So, since they lifted the siege, I should Hail probably take out this army right here. By your will, sire, we shall engage. I am going to auto resolve this. We, have we lost seven men. As you will, my king, to battle. And we'll execute Honor. that guy. This man is a proven leader. And would make a fine addition to our clan. Would you like to adopt him? Consider him as a son to carry on the noble clan's lineage. Let's see, strength is pretty good. Ambush, adapt, a lot of traits, logistics. Sure. Why not? Who was the benefactor again? Uh oh. Do you wish to choose the family member who will be the next heir of the faction? If you decline the option to select the candidate, it will not reappear until the faction leader dies. If you accept, you will be taken to the family tree screen. Then you choose a family member, accept leader and heir, and press the zoom. And what? Did someone die? Interesting. Isn't Kao Ang the faction heir? Because he's the son? Oh, that's weird. Oh, we sucked at him. Poor not, very poor. Oh, what? Poor to very king. poor. Probably should have sent my whole army out. With honor, sire. Hail my, hail my king. Oh, that was silly. However, I'm going to recruit some guys here. My lord. And I'll send a yellow turban. Oh, wait, yep, yellow turban bandits hail my king. to defend the city while they Making get back up to on their king. feet. And we're gonna try to relieve that force by uh, attacking. Alright, so it looks like we've done all we can here. Hail my, hail my king. We're covering some men here. Orders. And over here, well, besieged again. Hail my king. Sire. Let's see my if Lord. I lead a force out, take out Li Ying. Hail my king! Hail my king! 
I'm actually gonna go for Feng Yi. Because looks like an easy target to take. It'll take another two turns. And we also need to replenish some of our forces. However, I think we are done here, so I'm gonna end the turn. Alright, so Shen Pei is at it again. He's going to try and attack us, so we're going to fight the battle on the battlefield with the remnants of our army. I don't have much hope for this one because we only have 500 something men. Most of my men died in the previous battle. I don't even know if we'll have enough men to stop the siege tower this time around. There's just way too many, way too many men to stop. But we'll have to give it a try anyways. We'll have to block this tower. And I'll have these guys in defensive mode and we'll start the battle. Alright, so if we can stop the cavalry, then we should be okay. And who knows, maybe they'll revolt again. Ebay swordsman. So, these guys are going into the wild with a raging storm in front of them. They attempt to stop the siege tower from coming at them. The question is, can they do it? Can they stop the siege tower from reaching the wall and breaching the settlement? Our these county spearmen are here to or a military Stop the ladder can bring us victory from this. Only a fool could lose this battle to these Han volunteers. And I think they have already disabled my tiny force that tried to stop the battering ram. Yep. They are dead. Although I must say, this battlefield looks really nice. Ooh, friendly fire, nice. Ooh, cavalry. We're gonna have to fast forward this. Routed and yet still broken. So, our last hope is that they only come up this ladder and we can hold it. Hopefully, better than last time, but we'll see. Alright, so it looks like we have 30 seconds remaining, and unfortunately, this time they didn't climb the ladder for some reason. So, we survived. They only lost a few men. We lost, you know whoever we sent out to stop the other enemies of attack. Alright, we are back with lots of things that occurred in the previous turn. And we are financially a little bit better. We've improved by one from 20 to 19. Overall, we are number one in the other leaderboards. And construction reports of all these other things. Very nice, we actually got our mining complex. Recruitment reports, we've gotten a ton of capable spearmen. Well, county spearmen, wow, we recruited a lot. And war with Quingzhou, which is our northern neighbors over here. And, well, unaligned forces, we are apparently very poor with them. So here's our current financials. 
Potentially we can make 2300 in the next, 23,000 in the next turn. This settlement looks like it's under siege. Yep, you can see by the volcanoes. And we can... First, Hail we my do king. this. Ooh, Queen Horseman. Oh man, I'm oh, definitely hiring these guys. I need as many men as I can get, since I can't really punish any of these forces over here. Siege, so, sire. going to lay siege, in this siege to that sire. settlement over there. And, oh, there's some rebels over here as well. So we got a map from the Udomi sect. And they, wow, they're all the way over there. They're actually really close to us. Your money is good and with us, noble. I wouldn't mind if we could have an ally to our west, at least temporarily. I should focus and take this settlement. Before I, you know, fight off the rest of the... This is Liu Bao's faction. So, Jingzu, or Jing Zhao. My king. Uh, get these guys back in here. So people are happy again. And we can retrain some of these guys. Alright. This general is over here. First, we'll fight him in the next your video. Lands, then your lives! Alright, well we are out of time here, so I'd like to thank you guys all for watching, and I'll see you next time!